So I was playing Roblox recently, as I often do, let me tell you. And I saw some games that were very, very successful. There were games on Roblox that just focus on fashion, that just focus on being the best looking. Like uh, Fashion Famous, Roblox Fashion Show, Fashion Famous again, but with 5,000 less players. I don't know why there's two of them. There are two Fashion Famouses. Now, that's besides the point. The point is that these games do very, very well. And you know me, I'm very greedy. I want money, I want power. I want to burn down the local orphanages, normal things. So I thought to myself, how can I do that? I am going to make a fashion show. I'm making a fashion show inside of Roblox, then inviting a hundred people to come and play it, and then rating all of their outfits, seeing who's the best dressed, who is the worst dressed, who needs to be addressed, my home address, 1415 Oliver Road, and who we need to undress. And actually, I take back that last one, I might get arrested. <laughs> But yeah, today we're making a fashion show because I don't have any better ideas. So what is poppin', fashionistas? I'm going to rate your outfits and then you're going to cry once I give you a bad rating. Because honestly, if you are subscribed to my channel or support me in any way, you are ugly. Remember to like the video. <laughs> Remember to support me in any way after I said that if you support me in any way, you're awful. Alright, so first we need a runway. We're gonna need a stage for people to walk down. And the most important part of a fashion show is walking. Everybody knows that. Unless you're stupid. Are you stupid? Huh? Are you, stu you stupid? Huh? That's what I thought. Moron. But yeah, here's the runway. And then the stage behind it can just be like this. This is a beautiful fashion runway. It is literally just the letter T. It just looks like somebody pooped the letter T. <laughs> if this person poops rectangles. Oh no. <laughs> alright, alright. Now we need to make the invisible wall, which is something that I have messed up every single time I make a Roblox game. I don't know how. I don't know how I mess it up every time, but I do it somehow every time. And so don't expect me to get this right the first time because somehow I'll screw it up. I will mess it up. But yeah, with that being said, I am the most reliable YouTuber ever. I just uploaded at 4.30. That's reliable. People always come up to me and say, laughability, how are you so reliable? And I just tell them sort of the best, you know, it just comes with the territory of being the best ever. All right, back to fashion. So pretty much, I'm just expecting everyone's fashion sense to be god-awful, just horrible, just very bad fashion senses. I don't expect my fans to be dressed well, but who cares if they are? It's funnier if they aren't. All right, we're sending spawn points out here. And how this is gonna work is that I'm gonna bring them on stage and they're going to walk down it. And bubble chat's going to be enabled if I can remember how to do that. <laughs> so we can see the audience's reaction to them. We can see what the audience thinks about these guys, you know? Because that is what really matters. Actually, hold on. I just got an idea. You know how typically in fashion shows and everything, there's like a table of judges that sits there and judges fashion and whatnot? What if we have that here? What if we choose a random member from the audience to be our judge and they will determine whether the outfits are good or not? They will be the one who sees. Oh, this is the best game already and I haven't even made half of it. All right, all right, all right. All right, so let's move this chair over here. But we can't just have one dude Dude's sitting there, right? We need to have replacement judges next to him just so he doesn't feel lonely, you know? These aren't gonna be real people. They're just gonna be Roblox models, but who cares? I think the first of our two judges should be Jennifer. If you don't know who Jennifer is, I am, uh, I'm jealous of you. I wish I didn't know who Jennifer was, but she's my loving, beautiful wife who has the eyes of a dead fish. Aren't those horrifying? Look at them. Just look into them. Stare into her eyes for more than three seconds. I guarantee you can't. Let's take her off her high chair. Okay, Jennifer. Not so high and mighty anymore. You get to sit in a normal chair now. You're just like all those plebeians you so despise. There we go. So she is judge number one. Her chair is not going to be judge number two, contrary to popular belief. Who should judge number two be? What if I just look up laughability in models and see what I find? See what awful things I discover that I could make judge number three? Laughability. Ooh. Laughability head. Awesome. How about laughable H that is just a wrestler? Who is this made by? All right, Laughable H, you're here now. Unfortunately for us all, you have a health script. I'm deleting all of it because we don't need you to be healthy, Laughable H. We need you to judge clothing. You seem like in a very good place to judge clothing being almost completely naked. Laughable H can go in this chair. Our second judge of the fashion show. This is taking longer than I thought it would, but don't worry, we're going to upload it soon. Now, we just need to enable bubble chat, which is something I really hope I remember how to do, because there is a big 
big chance I don't, which, uh, oops. And now, if all goes according to plan, and I am not stupid, if I have more IQ points than my age, E. See, look, I'm a genius. I am so smart. I am so smart. I am so smart. Say it. Say it. Say I'm so smart. Please. Please. I need constant reassurance or else I will die. So remember to like the video to feed me attention. I'm joking. Like the video if you want to. It's your choice. <laughs> all right. Now it's time to upload the game. Publish to Roblox. But before we publish this game, it's the middle of the video. That means it's time for me to beg you to subscribe to the channel. All of the laughability subscribers are groaning in unison right now. <laughs> I like to ask you at the middle of the video because like by now, you know, if you want to subscribe or not. And I have said that like a thousand times. So it really is just your choice. If you like my content, you can subscribe. If you don't like it, you can unsubscribe. You can report my channel. You can bomb my house. You can mail me a pipe bomb. <laughs> you can take my family for ransom. Also, use star code laugh at checkout. It gives me money. It is so awesome. You would be so awesome if you use that, guys. Come on. All right, now it's time to publish the game. I am sick of begging. I reckon the title of the game should be My Fashion Show. Description is going to be Do you have fashion? Find out and become a true fascist. <laughs> Yes, we all want to be a fascist one day, you know? Become a true fascist today and show off your fashion sense. Famous fascists in history include Joseph Stalin. Did you know that? Did you know he was into fashion? Me neither. Until I looked up fascist and he was an example. All right, now we need to make it so this game can have 100 players. And I know I am just stalling till it goes public because I am too afraid. I am too afraid of the horrors that this game will create. I don't know how poorly this is going to go. Probably very poorly, honestly. Knowing my track record... Very, very poorly. <laughs> Fill each server as full as possible and it's time. We have to do it. We have to rip off the band-aid and upload the game because we're not getting any older. I mean younger. We're not getting any younger. <laughs> and everyone, get on your best outfit and join my fashion show. Okay, the only emoji reaction is middle finger and no and vomit. My Discord server is awful. By the way, discord.gg slash laugh if you want to join for some reason. All I ever do is bother you guys and make you come inside of my games. All right, now. Wow, why am I on one graphic setting on Roblox? Oh, because it's very laggy when I'm on Max. How could I forget? Awesome. I am very good at fashion right now. Look, look, guys, it's me. I am a gray blob. No one even knows it's me because I am just a gray blob. I'm gonna need to rejoin real quick just to make sure, you know. I only have, you know, 160 people playing. That is way too many. That is way too many. Why are they doing this? All right, time to announce it. Welcome to my fashion show. One of of you will be the judge. The rest will be judged. This Mauricio Pelosi guy seems very nice and humble. He's the only person not screaming and jumping around. So I'm gonna make you the judge. Maurice. Mauricio is the judge. And he is very, very laggy. Now, who wants to go first? Mauricio says, hi. <laughs> Hi, Mauricio. Hey, 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 Mauricio. How you doing? Mauricio Polisi. Here, let's bring this person first. Wow, they are horrifying. Why? <laughs> oh, yes, fly, fly, go. Yeah, go down the aisle. Go down the aisle. Mauricio, rate them out of 10. My lovable judge Mauricio with the pumpkin head. Me is good. Me? Bad. You are not speaking English words right now, but you know what? I'll forgive it. Can me hug? Okay, you're getting a little touchy. You're getting a little touchy-feely right now, buddy. Hey, hey you're getting a little touchy-feel. All right, Mauricio, what's your rating on that guy? It's spooky month. <laughs> C close enough, Mauricio. You know what? He's got spirit. Maybe his mind is a little in the wrong place, but he's got the spirit of a judge. I think he can judge this show, right? Just saying completely random things. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna bring a second judge, actually. I'm gonna bring the spy from TF2. Oh, Mauricio. Mauricio just left. No, you can't just leave, Mauricio. Why would you do that? Where did he go? Wait, is he even in the game anymore? No, he genuinely left. He actually left the entire game. But hey, at least X Pepper Kid is here. X Pepper Kid, our new judge. All right, next up, I'm bringing the guy who just said they are Elon Musk. There they are. I'm Elon Musk. <laughs> This is an awful outfit. I don't think Elon Musk would wear full plaid. Time to judge people based on appearance. Very dashing. Ooh, X Pepper could like you. That means you're going somewhere in life. X Pepper could the amazing judge. Yes, very, very. Okay, Musk, don't get too far ahead of yourself, buddy. Big rocket, you get. <laughs> yes, yes, thanks. Yes, yes. One out of ten. 
<laughs> Ex Pepperkin, very good rating. He's promising Ex Pepperkin a big Tesla. <laughs> All right, now, uh, get off the stage, dumbass. All right, next fashionista. This guy in chat just said spy gaming, so I'm bringing him. Walk down the runway, buddy. Elon Musk has perished. You, you're not wrong. What voice should I give this guy? I'll give him the Patrick Star voice. Monkey. <laughs> Four out of ten. Oh, pepper good. Kind of, kind of low. Thank you. And then they reset their character. That is so awesome. I think we got time for one more fashion. I'm bringing the one person. All they said in chat was just shark. That's all they said. And their name is shark themed. Oh my god. Please tell me they're a shark. They're a shark. Why is their name shark latex? That's not good. All right, pepper kid. What do you think? Shark. You're not wrong. Three out of ten because anatomically incorrect. Anatomically incorrect. Correct. All right, <laughs> death. The Pepper Kid wants you gone. I will get rid of you. That's it for the fashion show. Congrats, Pepper Kid, for being the best judge. I'm actually making him the owner of the game using Cole's admin. That is hilarious to me. I trust him. So subscribe if you liked it. Die if you don't. I don't care. <laughs> Bye. And comment who you think won the fashion show. Do it. Do it. I don't know. I have four brain cells.